Yeah, I grind. Hello, everyone. Uh, we're back, and I'm here with Zenrot. And we were just oh, talking. I like how you said that. Like a question? You had like the upward in the question inflection on the end? Yeah, so um, we were talking off screen about how I don't know how to intro anything, and I think it would help if I had a catchphrase. So I was thinking maybe my I should start all videos by saying, Hello, everyone. Are you ready for a fucking adventure? And so every video just starts that way. And this comes from the fact that uh, one of my one of the most recent videos I had, which was super months old, was Hamtaro, and that starts with "Hello, everyone. Are you ready for a fucking adventure with Hamtaro Hamamr Prank Part 2? <laughs> so I I'm, need this in my life. So starting from next episode, I will totally start with "Hey, hello, everyone. Are you ready for a fucking adventure?" And that will just be from now on how I start everything. <laughs> Let's test it out. Oh God. Uh, so we're here. I did some off-screen grinding. Let's just show where everyone's at. Uh, this is me, still level 39. Mr. Eat Your Butt, level 36. Zenrod is now at 44. JX, 43. Chase is 45. And Toast is at 38. So, decent amount of leveling, I'd say. Yeah. We What's up? I said, yeah, I would say so. Yeah. So we're here to try to catch and or kill the the, the another legendary whale. Can you guess which one this is? Can you guess who would be Articuno? No. Because there, there's a theme to it if you're paying attention. If the the Zap Dose being defreed is telling. Uh. Of course you're gonna peck me, asshole. Uh, was it Rhyme Akuno? Yes. Do you know why it's a rhyme? Is it because Articuno is number one and Rhyme is the biggest whale? No, but that's pretty funny if it was true. Is he actually the biggest <laughs> whale out of all of them? No, I, I'm assuming so. Okay, so... Put some money on it. <clears throat> um, So the three legendary whales... Oh, goddamn, you're going to peck me? You're going to do me like that? Uh, So Articuno is, of course, it's uh, Rhyme. Zapdos is D-free. And then, uh, one moment, let me click his choice to chase. And then Nanogenics is Moltres. Can you guess now that you know all the names of them, what the theme between them is, besides being whales? Uh, no. <laughs> okay, so one, two, and three. Does that help? Oh, I, that was my assumption, but I, I don't know what, how they would be numerically ranked. <clears throat> it's based off of when they first appeared on Modcast. Rhyme, uh, D-Free, oh, and Nano. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Chase might accidentally kill... Not um, that Nano was even ever on that show. Yeah, he was He was one of the last ones. <laughs> I would include Renzi, but Renzi is not a whale. Renzi is a hacker who is in jail. <laughs> Elite jail hacker. Exactly. So yeah, Nano was Nano's one is probably one of the the in terms of top tier um uh old modcast episodes, it is the one where we kill Common at the end. That's the goat, that's the okay. end of season two. Yeah. Uh and then there's the one with nanogenics because we talk about the fucking racist hood KKK member in um from the movie. You know what I'm talking about, fucking Hydrogeton. Hey, Hachi. What the hell are you talking about? It's it's the one that looks like a KKK member. The one from uh, Attack of the Saiyans. Oh, Hachiak. Hachiak, yeah. And I compared him to a Ku Klux Klan member. <laughs> and I just remember, that's the one thing I remember most from that episode. And Nano's is also... Pointy head, is that why? Yeah. I mean, you, you should watch that old Modcast episode to get a, a good idea as to why he's like that. Uh, also, he's extremely hard to catch, this fuck. I looked up the odds of this, by the way. We have, at most, a 10% chance of catching him. Nice. And, of course, as soon as I say that... <laughs> oh, it <took. laughs> it's like a It's like a gotcha when you're like, I'm quitting this fucking game, and then you pull exactly what you want, so you don't quit. Yeah, right now, we just pulled Hit. That was what we did with Rhyme. <laughs> yeah, we'll give a nickname to Articuno. Uh, what did you say, Rhyme Akuno? Makuno. Now here's the part or, where I or or Artadino. Oh, that's pretty good too. Artadino is really it's a really fun name. 
Both are pretty good. I'm gonna go with Artadino because I know how to spell that 100%. Uh, <laughs> Artadino. And of course, the his other half, his uh, his shadow half, is uh, Mr. Rhyme style. So, yes. Artadino. And I really wish Mr. Rhyme style could have happened. That's a that's a really good one. That's another that's another Pokemon for another adventure. Uh, now we can just get the fuck out of this cave. I like, unfortunately, Chase has fallen, but you have dig. So let's get the fuck out of here. We're gonna Don't dig worry. underwater. I'm digging us right the fuck out of here. Here's the question: How the fuck did we dig all the way back here? Uh, it's take it's take, it's like teleport. Yeah, apparently so. So here's another thing: So we're gonna go challenge Giovanni. We're gonna win this time. This time we're gonna win. Uh, should we replace maybe me? Well, not me because I have Solar Beam. Well, no, I'm not gonna help because I'm level 38. Actually, no, I could still win because I have Psychic. Let's look at our team real we can't, quick. We can't replace you because you're one of you and me. So we we both have to always be there. Yeah. So the answer is, should we, for only this fight, because this is going to be, a, uh, we're going to keep, um, what I'm saying is Toast goes for now because he's not going to be much help. And then we put in uh, Artadino for the fight. Yes. All right. That was my, that was the basic way of saying I'm also going to give him Fly over Peck because I don't know why the fuck he has Peck. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> all right, let's deposit Toast real quick. Toast going in the box. How do they all have one shitty weak move? I don't know. I like <laughs> I like Z Free right next to Artadino. And Execute, who is the uh, the forbidden Execute I accidentally caught when I was going through the Safari Zone to get strength. <laughs> all right, this time we're totally going to be up Giovanni. There's no way he can stand the chance of an actual legendary. If he does, I'll eat my hat. Yeah. If he wins this time, he maybe he deserved to win, and we're not very good trainers. Just better man. Ah, uh, damn it! I have to actually. He's, not. <laughs> he's by the way, he's, he needs to be healed, and he's paralyzed. <laughs> well, it's good you didn't just walk in. No, that would have been funny though if I did. <laughs> if I just walked in that with the. Would have been a little funny if he was still just screwed up from the battle with us. Yeah, he's like, all right, we got it. Go, Dino. <laughs> Beat him down. Oh, and then he dies. Right after. He gets <laughs> thundered. I mean, the unfortunate thing is that he's still... There's a good chance that well, maybe he'll, we'll just lose him the thunder. Yeah, he's still vulnerable to the, the thunder gambit. Damn them. Come on, version of the Griggle Gambit when you think about it. <laughs> yeah, it's really the, the the Thunder Gambit, which is putting down a Pokemon who is a fucking ground type, and all of a sudden they know fucking Thunder. Yeah, for for seemingly no reason they know Thunder. It, uh, the the reason they have Thunder is to fuck me over. That's the reason why is to take my goddamn money. So I believe Fly is HMO two. Yeah. Zero. Yes. This is really going to be the test of my knowledge if I can remember all the all the facts about Pokemon. I can't wait till we get some Moltres because he's going to be a real pain in the ass to actually get. He sure is. I hate. Wait, he's my what? least favorite one to deal with. Uh, I'm going to do a quick check on why the fuck you only knew three moves, Artadino. <laughs> wow, what? <laughs> what the fuck is this move? Two moves. Bad RNG, man. He didn't roll the other moves. Yo, he ran out of stones before he could pull the other moves. Ran out of stones after getting Ice Beam. <laughs> so he re-rolled and he got... He had to settle for the R. <laughs> so I re-rolled this account. I have Peck and I have Ice Beam. Is that good enough? Is that a good start? Rerolled SSR, Ice Beam, and R Peck. Yeah, R Peck. Leader of the Peck Force. All right, I think we're. I'm gonna start off with him in the front, just because it's going against a Doug Trio, and I really did not want to put me in the front because I think I'm. Am I actually bug flying? Would I actually be good against a Doug Trio? Now that I think about it. Bug flying. Okay, you know what? Moves. You'll get like. Because I have Solar Beam. Look at me. Look actually, out. you have the same. You have the same weakness chart against Ground types that Articuno does. So yeah, it's fine. All right. We're going to start with me, because out of everyone that can die here, I'm the most fragile. And there's also a 50-50 chance that he just uses Slash 
and I die before I can use my solar beam. Very likely. I like to think of, oh, I went the wrong fucking way. Why didn't you tell me, Chase? Why didn't you say anything? I like to think that uh, because Common is no longer on the team, when I use solar beam, it's like the father-son Kamehameha. So he shows up <laughs> in the background of me using it. And he helps oh, me. that's good. Yeah, I'm going to post that up later with no context. A uh, a Butterfree, and then the background is a half-dead Vitasaur. Alright, we're going to beat you now this time. We have the power of a whale on our side. We would have used D-Free, but Z-Free literally is the worst person we could bring to this fight. Yeah, he is completely useless in here. I can't believe he only knows Peck and Ice Beam. What kind of... It's it's stuff like that makes you realize Gen One is really janky in a lot of ways from like what you expect. It sure from... is. Okay, you know what? What if I sleep powder and then no no solar beam? Yeah, eat shit. You can't hit me. I'm a fucking flying bug, asshole. <laughs> solar beam, give me strength, common. Damn it, common. Go, common, go. Oh, you're gonna use guard spec. It's not enough. I do this for my good friend, Common. Who's not dead, but he's just in the box. He's just kind of chilling. Might as well be dead. That's that's the equivalent of dead for us, is when you end up in the box. Yes, and Stay now... in the box for eternity. This is the rematch. Chase, this time we're going to have to have you actually kill him. And not lose half our team members to a fucking Persian. Yes. Yeah, that would be good if if maybe we beat the Persian this time. Get ready, because it looks about Ding. like you're going to get Thunderstruck! I fucking love that. Nice. Yeah, that was about a 50-50. Okay, now I can't use it anymore because he's using double team. Because he's an asshole. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. It's, it's not all right. good. He's not going to do shit. Chase is too strong. He's been training off screen. How the fuck did Thunderbolt do... Almost the exact same damage as Thunder. I mean, they're pretty close in power. I want to just give a quick recap of what Chase did. He used all four moves. He's like John Cena. He used all the moves. Talented. Okay, Nido Queen. Skill set is so varied. So, okay, so who do we think? Should we start with you from off the bat or start with Artadino? Against what? Uh, it's Nido Queen. Oh god. Um Do we want to bait the thunder? Start with Ardodino. No, but he has 10, so it's not going to be much use. I'm going to go uh, with it, No, there's no point in baiting thunder. It's not going to make a difference. Let's go with you. I I I don't remember if they take double damage from earth, do you know? They I are poison because they're poison type. But the thing is is that I'm afraid if I use dig you're going to die to earthquake. So we could. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, that's a good call. Should we just slash and hope you crit her to death? Yeah, probably. Go slash. We'll I'm know right faster. now. Yeah, you're faster. Well, you're insane. Okay, she doesn't know earthquake. Otherwise, she would have used it already. So I'm gonna use a uh, dig on my turn. If you would have used it, yeah, you don't know it, <laughs> asshole. Eat the dig. She's down. Yeah. Yeah. Zen out here taking down queens left and right with digging. Nah, you're going to handle this one too. I'm going to laugh if we're going to end up not needing Artadino at all. Oh no, last one is Rhyhorn. <laughs> is that correct? Um... Right? It has to be. It's that or Kanka's gone. Oh, you I'm did like ninety percent sure it's right on. You didn't kill? Oh, come on, survive the double kick. Yes, tank. All right, don't crit. Don't crit. Get him. Slash. Unstoppable. The unstoppable Zenrado as a sand God, slash. I love the sand shrew line. I love them so much. They're real good. It is right on. So for this one. No, he might die. Screw it. You need to show some. I need to have some reason why we got rid of Toast. God, look at that fucking weird janky face. 
It actually kind of looks like the Art of Dito is doing an O face right now from the other side. <laughs> it does. Oh, super effective. Oh, <laughs> okay. There we go. We did it. Now that was a full on stomping. We didn't lose a single Pokemon. And also, yeah, that, that was very different from the last fight. Also, congrats, Enron. I think you're about to get Earthquake. Let's see. Ah, uh, yes. Give it to me. You can enter the Pokemon League. It is my gift to your Pokemon League challenge. TM27. Damn it, it's Fissure. Oh my god, really? Yeah. Not Earthquake? I think it's Earthquake in uh, red and blue. They must have changed it. Right? You would you remember that it was Earthquake? No, it's Earthquake and Fire Red and Leaf Green. Ah, oh, damn it. Maybe that's the one I'm thinking blue. of. So that means that Earthquake might just be around somewhere, and if that's the case, then I'll just find it and give it to you after the fact. Um, We're going to keep Artadino in the team, because we're about to fight Dokkan. And actually, let's just make this one big-ass episode and call it the Rhyme Style Special, where we're also going to take down uh, Dokkan using... Uh, using rhyme he won't be there for the final fight though okay. all right let's see let's go take down dokkan and then after this we're gonna actually you know what we're very close uh we're gonna have one more time skip and there will be i think either one or two more episodes depending on how long it takes to catch uh nanogenics the moltres which we need to come up with a name for him nanotress uh moltgenics <laughs> <laughs> we have to catch Multianics, but that and then hopefully Um I will train everyone off screen and we will have our final go. I think at least level it, it, at least level N A N O R T R E S Nano L R Moltres. <laughs> Alright, when the time comes we will name him that. For right now, it's time to take down Dokon. Dokkan's not even going to face me fight. Oh, wow. What an asshole. I hate you so much, Dokkan. The dick. I'll whip you, Cam, as a warm-up for the Pokemon League. He came to me, by the way. He's going the wrong direction. He's walking out of the way he's supposed to be going. What an unbelievable asshole. And he's then he's going to use you. That's why I'm here. I'm here to take down Zenato. Common, <laughs> give me strength. Wokey took in sunlight. You're gonna use poison sting on me, bro? And you, oh, it's actually super effective. It doesn't matter though, because I have the power. She did a lot. Well, I am a butterfree. What? Damn it, Common! Why can you never kill with our move? <laughs> well. All right, I'm taking him out with my psychic blast. One of these days, Solar Beam's gonna kill in one hit, and I'm gonna be so happy. <laughs> but until that day comes, <laughs> well, you know what it is? It's that I'm a level 39, so yeah, it's not helping. No, it's not helping. Um, that was an execute, so we're just gonna go full on Dino for this one. Arda Dino, he's gonna take him down. Wow, level 45 execute. Get ready to get hit by the O. He's immune to Stun Spore because we already used that move on him. <laughs> well, we used uh, Thunder Wave. I also like that I could not get rid of uh, Thunder Wave from Chase uh, for the exact reason of that um, it's uh, we need it to catch. Because without thunder, without a uh, some kind of paralysis on him or like sleep, it is borderline impossible to catch a legendary. Yeah, it's not worth even trying. Yep. So we're going to need that up until the end. Wow, you crit the Magneton. You don't even need Earthquake, apparently. You can just kill without it. I don't even need a switch. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty great. You're going to take down this Ninetales. I like to think every time you take down a Ninetales, it is actually your statement on all the score buddy fans who are furries. This is actually his yeah, full that, rage. That's my opinion on, on furries, is me killing Ninetales. Yeah. You don't mean you don't want to kill them. You just want to kill the concept of them. Yeah, I want to kill their 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 thought process. Shout out to Hope, who's in who is an Eevee. I should actually ask Hope what Eevee she wants to be. 
Uh, oh, oh yeah, she's just a, a currently unused Eevee. Yeah. Well, I, I think at least she deserves to have like the, her choice and what she wants to be. I just forgot. I thought it was an Abra. I'm sorry, Mister Eevee, but I'm sorry. I for- <laughs> <laughs> I underestimated a lot. <laughs> this is my bad. This is my bad. I don't know. I think he's okay. I think he's okay. Oh. I'm sorry. I really thought that it was something he, else. He was not okay. He was not okay. Bite him. Take him down, Jax. Now, here's the problem with Dokkan is that this Kadabra is a, a real problem. Turns out when you right. put... Yeah, that's not great. So, Psychic is extremely powerful in the hands of a Butterfree. Imagine if that was put on an actual good Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, uh. that's a problem. But it's okay because Jex used his uh his his main move, which is just biting the shit out of somebody, and he won. It, it gets the job done. All right. Yeah, one hundred percent. And speaking of taking down EV forms, no, Chase, how could you miss with Thunder? Could you miss with this notoriously inaccurate move? It's apparently seventy percent. That is bad. What are you talking about? 70%, 70% of the time it hits 100% of the time. And look, he's paralyzed. <laughs> Worth it. Okay, this might be a problem for Chase. <laughs> I did not count on the fact that the Vaporeon would have a good water move. Ah, Chase, you are just made of paper, buddy. He is. Uh, I guess I'll come in. Can I solar beam the Vaporeon to death? This is the questions I ask myself at night. <laughs> Uh, uh, I really hope you don't get hit and die first. He's too, he's too scared. The most durable Pokemon I've ever seen. Uh-oh. Uh, I guess it's time to use Psychic, because again, Solar Beam not doing what I wanted to, because uh, Common, his part of the deal is just like on, okay, this is the part where I have to lower his special attack, don't I? I forgot, he's a special tank, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna have to get rid of that then. Goodbye. Oh god. Oh fuck! I forgot that when he uses um, haze, it get it gets rid of rid of paralyzes of effect of making him go last. Also this is the gone. Yeah, this is the world's strongest Vaporeon, and it's about to die to psychic, so it's fine. I'm very lucky that he stopped. Wait, so he only has one attack move? It's Hydro Pump. I guess, which means he only has eight uses of it. Yeah, so that's good to know for the final fight. What? I was just careless. All right. And Chase is gone. I'm ready for the Pokemon League. Yeah, he got nuked. As is tradition, he got nuked. Uh, What do you mean I fucking need more practice, motherfucker? I just beat you down with a level 39. I need more practice. You lost. I'm sorry, who's level 35, uh, level 55 Vaporeon got killed by a level 39 Butterfree? That's what I thought. And it's pretty crazy we're about to walk into the Elite Four with a level 39 Butterfree. It just goes to show you that uh, Psychic is extremely overpowered in this game. And that Wokeyfree is the world's strongest Butterfree. Like, look at the... I, I'm going to tell you right now. Butterfree there's ever been... The reason that uh, uh, Toast was bad for so long is that his kit was bad. Look at this shit. He knows Psychic. <laughs> he knows Psychic. That automatically puts him on a pedestal. Yeah, that is pretty impressive, actually. That's a, that's a good Butterfree skill set right there. Yes, it, it knows everything you needed to know. It knows Sleep Powder. So if it goes first, it can just put him to sleep. It knows Harden in case it needs to go hard. And then it knows Solar Beam when it wants to talk to his friend, Common. In case it needs to be harder. Yes, because sometimes there are play- there are times when a man needs to get hard, and that's true. <coughs> I feel like that was God's way of saying stop talking. <laughs> Time to drop it. Yeah, drop drop everything you're about to say. We're okay. So this episode is almost over, but I wanted to at least showcase the intro to the Pokemon League because I think it's really cool when you get in here for the first time. Especially if, I love like, the first traveling through the Pokemon League. It's so great. Yeah, and that's also why I brought uh, Chase back from uh, the brink of faintingness. Is that he can be here with us for the special moment. 
Look at this guy. Oh, that is the boulder badge. Go right ahead. Damn right. Bet it's the boulder badge. You let me in. Let me in. You can pass here only if you have the cascade badge. Oh, that is the cascade badge. Go on ahead. Damn right. Ain't nothing gonna bring me down. Ain't nothing gonna break my stride. Ain't nobody gonna hold You're me damn down. Damn right, that's the cascade badge. Oh, what's that? What do, do you I know need? What the cascade badge is? Thunder badge. I got the thunder badge. As a kid, I used to come back here all the time and go like, "I have another badge," and I would go slightly farther ahead. I'm gonna walk the path. I got another one. <laughs> That's right. Oh, there's a bunch of ocean? It's okay, because I have the rainbow badge. Damn right. It permits me to surf on your ocean. Actually, it, through the it, menus, because it, this is the Gen 1 Pokemon game. Yeah, also it doesn't. That's uh, that's Koga's badge, but that's beside the point. But this guy, you can only pass if you have the soul badge. Oh, that is the soul badge. Please go right on ahead. I love how everyone's just like, oh yeah, you do have the thing, okay. Yeah, everyone's like, there's multiple, like, <laughs> that's the marsh badge. <laughs> Damn right. Let me go. Let me pass. I almost like not running into any Pokemon here. I could have swore as a kid. Oh, so this is where I think I can actually catch a Dodrio if I wanted to. There's Nidoking in here, too. You can't pass here only if you have the Volcano badge. Oh, that is the Volcano badge. Damn right. Going on my way. Making my way. I accidentally took a wrong turn. <laughs> That's not going to stop this awesome moment. <laughs> you can only Walking, pass here. Not embarrassed. We're fine. Earth badge. Oh, that is the earth badge. Please go right ahead. And now here it is. The awesome moment where you learn that there's another fucking cave. <laughs> <laughs> we did it. We're about to walk into the Pokemon. Oh. I'm out of here. <laughs> no, I was about to. <laughs> All right, the Pokemon dream is not worth it. Yeah, uh, so Cam never went to the Pokemon League. All right, everyone. We will see you next time where we will catch Nano LR Gen. No, Nano LR Tris. Yes. I really just want to, to Cam to have walked in and seen the cave and then turned around and walked out, and just the retired symbol from JoJo comes up on the screen. <laughs> I'm out of here. You didn't fucking tell me there was another cave. Asshole. All you said you wanted was my earth badge. And then I think, I want to say at one point you have to use flash in that cave too. So it literally uses every single HM possible. Because it's an asshole it's final. A it's a nightmare. It's a nightmare you guys aren't going to see. So we'll see you all for what is potentially the last episode of Pokemon. I mean, we'll see. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. See you all later. Goodbye. Bye.